Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to perform the texture painting for your character creator for 3D Avatar. So now I'm going to show you some of the, the textures that I downloaded from everywhere. Just for example, I have a wood texture, I have an iron texture, I have a gold texture. So how to perform the texture painting on the character creator for avatar, what is the easiest way? For me, the, the easiest way to perform the texture painting for your CC4 avatar is just by using the blender. And I'm going to show you actually it is just a really easy step. The first step, I'm going to click file export the FBX as a cloth character. The target tool preset, I choose the blender. Then the FBX option, of course, I just select the mesh. Then I can click export. And as demo, I'm going to export it on my desktop. I will create a new folder. I named this as Camilla because this, this is CC4 Camilla. I named the FBX as Camilla. So I click save. It is going to export as FBX. And then we are going to import the FBX file into Blender. So this is the Blender 3.6. I'm going to press A and delete everything. Just clear everything. Next, I click File, import the FBX from my desktop, from the Camilla's folder, the Camilla FBX. Now, the Blender 3.6 is importing the CC4 Camilla. Then, just turn on the texture. And then, at first, you can just fix some of the texture, for example, the hair. I'm going to just select the hair, then click the material under the hair's transparency. The blend mode, I change it to become the alpha hash, then everything will back to the normal. Next, I'm going to show you how to perform the texture paint. Just for example, I want to, to paint on the body mesh included the face. I just click and select it. Then, next, I'm going to click the texture pin. Then, scroll like this, turn on the texture. Then, this is for the texture pins too. You can change the radius, just for example. For this, you can choose any of the color. Then you can directly change the radius of the brush that you can perform the texture paint. But this is just a color paint. What I'm going to show you is the real texture paint, how to paint the wood. So I am going to press Ctrl Z to undo it. To perform the real texture paint, I just need to click here under the texture. I click plus new. I'm going to open it from my desktop. Open the textures folder. It is here. So by default, it is just a list. I'm going to click here so that you can see the thumbnail. Let's say I want to paint some woods. Then next, I will just back to the back, back to here, change the radius of the brush. Let's say I will put 29. Let's say now if I paint that here, you can. It is still green. Just press Control Z. Then back to the back to here. Because of just now, I adjusted the color. I click here, go for the RGB, or just put it as one. Then it will back to the white color. Then if I direct paint it, you can see it is going to paint the wood. But if I scroll like this, it is going to paint with a bigger texture. So if, if you back to the texture here, just scroll down under the mapping. The repeat X and if you increase the size of the repeat X and the repeat Y, then it is going to make the texture to become more smooth. Now, it is become smaller. Look, let's say if you, you make this number to become 2 and 2, then it is going to paint with not that smooth. Now you can see. By default, it is 1. Then, 
if you paint it the whole face already become the wood of course you can paint on body as well now I'm going to test some of it then if I change the texture I, I click open I open the iron I can paint it here what about if you want to paint symmetry you can just click here scroll down to find the symmetry then you take the X then if you pin one side another side will be balanced together this is the symmetry if you take again to deselect the symmetry then you are going to just pin one side right now I click open as I open the goal I'm going to pin the goal like this so what about if you want to export it and import back to the character creator 4 it is pretty easy always remember for the character creator 4 the CC4 of the texture are just 4 alright now you check back your CC4 you only have a, a few a few texture for the skin the first one is the head then body arm and the leg so from the blender you can choose it from here choose it from here the diffuse let's say the body diffuse the body diffuse then I click image save as then I'm going to save it on my desktop then under the camilla I right click to create a, a new folder new texture new texture then I click save as image then we check it under the camilla new texture now this is the new body skin image now you can see the gold and the iron next is the face the face already have some of the wood texture you choose it from here the skin face the skin head diffuse this one then I click image save as then on desktop Camilla, new texture, the skin head diffuse, I could save. Then, the next one, this is the skin arm. So, cho you choose it from here, the skin arm diffuse as well. Some wood texture is already there. I click the image, save as, under the Camilla's folder. Wait. On my desktop, Camilla new texture I click save the image then for this part these are the leg just click here legs skin skin leg diffuse click image save as then on the desktop Camilla new texture save as the image now for these four textures already saved, you can import back to, to the character creator 4. Just check one by one. This is the leg, the skin face, skin head. Now you can see this skin already have the wood texture. It is pretty easy. Just come back to your character creator 4, click the skin head. Once you click the skin head, just scroll down. You can see the base color this is under the material then under the new texture I'm going to drag and drop drag and drop now you can see this face already become wood then just find let's say the skin body scroll down this is the skin body I choose from here the skin body diffuse drag and drop then the skin arm also do the same way scroll down the skin arm here next is the skin leg if I scroll now, you, you already can see that some of the bodies already have the texture pin.
because of I already replaced the material texture, the diffuse base color. Now just left the leg just, just to see what happens. Right, this is the skin leg. I drag and drop to the base color. Now you can see you already have some some skin, some iron skin, some gold skin, even some wood skin. It is really easy to perform the texture paint for your CC4 avatar just by using the blender. And the blender is a free software you can use anytime, you can download it anytime from the Blender's official site. If you do not yet get the CC4, the Character Creator 4, you can just scroll down, go to my video description. I already put a CC4 official link. You can get it from Relusions. And if you not yet get the Blender, you can scroll down, go to my video description as well. Get it from my video description. All right, that's all for today about my tutorials on how to perform the texture paint for a CC4 avatar, the Character Creator 4 avatar. Alright, that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my videos, tutorials, and sharing, if you feel all these tutorials and sharings are very helpful to your 3D modeling, 3D animation, and 3D game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorials or sharing, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy! Happy 3D modeling, 3D animation, and 3D game developing. See you!